Hi guys, and today we're going to be looking at the XV95 Ghost Kill Battle Suit. And first of all, I want to say a huge thank you to Goblin Gaming for sending me this kit out for review. So please check in the description box down below where you'll find a link to Goblin Gaming and you can check them out for yourselves. Okay, I'm just going to show you a little detail of the box art. We can see the Ghost Kill on the sides. But the real details on the back, if I just zoom in a little and just show you some of the details. Now, really cool thing with this kit is you can actually ha have the uh, hatch at the front of the ghost kill open so you can see the commander inside, which is a, a really cool uh, feature. And you also get two drones as well with this kit. So what I'm gonna do now is cut the video and we're gonna have a look at the sprues inside. So in the box we get two bases, clear bases for the drones, which actually can be used as magnifiers. No, I'm just saying that they magnify. Uh, so we get two clear bases for the drones. We get a large base for the ghost kill. And we also get what I absolutely love, decals, some water slide decals. Now I wish Bandai would include all their kits with uh, water slide decals and not those stickers. So. Props to Games Workshop for not including stickers and giving us water slide decals, which I absolutely love. And I will be using a lot of these on my kits as I will be painting up the um, Ghost Kill and the rest of my uh, Tau units in the colour scheme with the white and the red, which I believe is the Vorlicept. I think it's Vorlicept. So, yeah. Um, that's that. I'm going to cut it and we're going to have a look at the sprues. So we have the first sprue here in front of us and we've got some of the drones here, some of the weapons, some of the armour. I love the panel line detailing on the tow armour. I mean they're going to hold a, a pin wash or a panel line wash really really well. So that's the first sprue. We'll look at the next sprue. Got some of the chest or leg parts of the armor. I can't quite make out what that is there. Got a nice missile pod down here. I'll zoom in and show you the bare heads that are in the top left hand corner. They look really cool. So that's really nice details there. And we're going to go on to the last sprue. We've got some weapons down here. Some weapons on the reverse of the sprue. And some more armour plating. Now I can't wait to get started on this guys. Hopefully this should be uploaded on the day of release. Which is... Uh, really good and again I want to say a huge thank you to Goblin Gaming for making sure I get this on the day of release you can check them out in the description box down below but hopefully over the next few days I'll be able to do a building tutorial video on the ghost kill and then hopefully a painting tutorial following that so stay tuned to my channel over the next few days while I get the build video up and then after that hopefully the tutorial should follow not too far afterwards so thanks for watching this guys if you enjoyed it please tickle the like button and i'll catch you in the next one